Hey everybody, welcome to another quick and easy tutorial by Crispy Jeb and today we're going to talk about how to install Fallout London. First things first, you're going to have to own Fallout 4 and all of its DLC content to be able to use this mod. Secondly, we're going to have to get rid of that pesky next gen update and we're going to achieve that by using the Fallout 4 downgrader and downgrading the game to a earlier version that works with this mod. Once you have the downgrader downloaded, you're going to want to navigate to your downloads folder and open up the zip file. From there, you're going to want to navigate to the Foland downgrader folder, launch foland-downgrader.exe. Once the application is launched, it's going to ask you where Fallout 4 is installed on your system. The quickest way to determine this is to go into your Steam library, navigate to Fallout 4, right-click on it, go to Manage, and Browse Local Files. From here, you may have to click the up arrow to determine exactly which drive your game is on if you have multiple drives. Now that you know where Fallout 4 is installed on your system, click on this little folder icon and tell the application where your game is installed. From here on out, just simply follow the instructions on screen to log into your Steam account. Once you have done that, click this downgrade Fallout 4 button and let the application do its thing. Alright, we're in the home stretch here. Next, we need to launch the GOG application and find Fallout London in the store. Go ahead and purchase it for free. Now navigate to your GOG library and find Fallout London and click install. After it's done downloading, at this point, the GOG application will ask you to tell it where Fallout 4 is installed on your system. Before you do this, please note that installing Fallout London will make irreversible changes to the default Fallout 4 installation. You'll also need to disable cloud saves as the save folder is shared between the game and the mod. If you'd like to play the default Fallout 4 game again, you will need to uninstall the game and the mod and then reinstall Fallout 4. Alright, now with that out of the way, we can finish. Last step of the process is to click on the change location button, navigate to Fallout 4 again like previously, click install here, and then click install once more. And now simply let the files process. Congratulations, you're all done. Thank you for watching. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and leave a tip if you can. Take care of yourself, goodbye, and good luck.